For chair side pickup of the denture retentive component, transfer the position of the O-balls to the tissue bearing surface of the denture by marking the heads of the O-balls with a lead pencil or insert soft silicone or soft wax inside the denture. The location of each implant is transferred to the denture. Using a resin burr, relieve the opening around the abutment impressions or markings in the denture by approximately 5 millimeters. Try the denture in the patient's mouth and verify that the appliance is seated passively while in maximum intercuspation. The O-balls should not touch any part of the denture. Snap a retentive housing assembly over each O-ball. Try the denture in the patient's mouth again and check to ensure that the appliance is seated passively while in maximum intercuspation. Remove the retentive housings. To prevent any acrylic lock-on, punch holes in a rubber dam at each implant site and place the dam over each abutment, leaving only the O-ball heads exposed. Snap a retentive housing assembly over each O-ball in preparation for the final seating. Clean, wash, and dry the denture. Fill the abutment recesses with self-cure resin. Paint a small amount of this material over each retentive housing. As soon as the acrylic in the denture becomes resistant to flow, seat the denture, keeping light, bilateral pressure on the occlusal surface. Have the patient close gently into maximum intercuspation. Allow the acrylic to fully polymerize. After the acrylic has set, remove the denture and rubber dam. Trim flash and fill any minor voids or discrepancies. Ensure that there are no sharp edges on the tissue bearing surface of the denture. Recheck the occlusion. Confirm proper occlusal contacts.